Hello guys, and today I got an insulator. And there's a glass insulator you'd find on top of a, an older telephone pole. Um, I bought this one. No, I think I... No, um, I, I don't know how I got this one. But it's a Hemming Grade 20. And as you can see, it's a blue-green insulator. And it's kind of a simple design. Um, it it kind of looks like uh, the Hemming Grade 42. Um, but it is, it just has that classic Hemming Gray kind of design. Um, it looks a little, like I said, it looks a little bit like the Hemming Gray 42. It's glass, it's a real glass insulator. Um, and, um, this one was found, like, all, all these insulators are from, uh, southern Ontario. So, um, there's a guy, um, and he, what he does is he finds these insulators, and, uh, he'll sell them, and... So I got a lot of them. I have found a few. Um, and so yeah, um basically that's basically your hammer for you. It's got these teeth, it's got the teeth in the bottom. Uh, most insulators have these teeth. This is where the the, the the wood screw would go in and that would be mounted on top of the telephone pole so this is where it would go in and um i see this one is probably late 18 maybe the 1890s 1880s uh because it's not as old as a couple i have and the oldest ones are wooden insulators, but they don't have any because they're extremely rare. They're only made for about 10 years, and they usually go for around $400. But uh, this one, sadly, is only worth like 15 bucks. Um, my insulator pricing guide, um, it's very, very old book. Um, so it'd say this is probably around five bucks, but now it's about 12, 13, 15, maybe. But, uh, yeah. So, if I get any views on this video and you have a Hammond Grade 20, just comment uh, on it. And if you know the year, uh, comment on the video to, uh, say what year it is. And, um, yeah.